Hi everyone, my name is BG Mike. Welcome to a game called Amori. Now I know that sounds kind of Italian. Amori. Um, I've been requested to play this game by so many people, and every time I live stream, every time, every video, I see a comment of someone asking me to play Amori. So you know what to do. Smash that like button if you want to see some more. Okay? The only thing I've seen about this game is the trailer, and, uh, you know what? Actually, since we're playing Amori, I need to go switch it to something a little more comfortable that's more fitting for this. How about that? Does this art style look a little familiar? It should. Alright, that's much better. We got it on full screen. Everyone keeps comparing this game to, uh, Undertale, Earthbound, Doki Doki. <laughs> My scrubs, let's get it started. Don't worry. Everything is going to be okay. No matter what happens. Promise me that we'll always be there for each other. Promise me. Yeah, I saw the trailer and it looks so good. So like, it's really artsy in a way, like really cool. Welcome to white space. Is he like in his boxers? You have been living here for as long as you can remember. That's a very fat cat. A tissue box wiping your sorrows away. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Wow, what very artsy pictures he has. Yeah. So I know this game was developed by Omo Cat, which is obviously like the shirt that I'm wearing. They did a Doki Doki Literature Club line. So. I had to buy it, it looked really cool. I just didn't know that they were game developers too. I, for all I knew, they just did clothes, but yeah. Apparently this game also was in development for a very long time. And it finally came out, and it was like something that was really exciting. And I, I've just been requested by so many of you to play it, so... There's gotta be a reason why. What would you like to do? Stare at the screen, open your journal. Stare at the screen all day! You stared at the screen. What would you like to do? Okay, let's open the journal. Today I spent uh, time in white space. Everything was okay. And it's like that for everything else. Amori's journal. Is my name Amori? Is that is that their name? The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. Yeah, that that gives me, Hey, I, I, I crawled out of the room. Uh, that reminds me of Undertale. Which, by the way, I need to finish. I know... It just, I don't know guys, it just takes a certain game to really keep me excited. So yeah, I can't say... It's really just whether or not you guys are like pumped enough for it, then I'll like play more, but it really depends. What is this? A hand? A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Nothing. You stared at the door. What about this light bulb? Can I- no? I can't do anything with the light bulb? Okay, well... I'll go this way. No! Get away from me, hand! It was a little- oh god, they chase you. I will escape this white space! Ah. Oh. <laughs> uh, that's not- that's not fair, man. Yeah, surely if I go to the top of the light bulb, there will be an end. Well, why do they chase you anyway if you're just gonna get stuck? Well, what a unique start to the game. Alright, let's get caught again. It's 
kind of disorienting just to be, uh, to have like nothing. Uh, meow, waiting for something to happen? I was? Something fell nearby. Well, let's go find it, shall we? No, it's gotta be this way. Oh, there it is. A knife! Yay! Just what I always want to see in these games. You got a shiny knife! So I think this is also an RPG, um... Much like Undertale. You know, I'm not saying- I'm not comparing it to Undertale. I've never finished Undertale, so... I only know what I know, but it does give me those, you know, those vibes. Oh, well I guess we should equip our shiny new knife. No, never mind. Maybe we can use this to get out. Wait, I- oh, I pressed open. I kind of skipped a little too much. Oh, well I can leave now. Oh, wow, this game's adorable. Hi, Morty. We were hoping that you'd come by soon. Aubrey? Wanna play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Oh. Whoops. Never mind. Aw, oh, man. What the heck, Aubrey? You messed up all the cards. I was winning, too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get angry. It's just a game, after all. Don't give me that, hero. You only say that because you, uh, you were losing. Why is Kel always so mean to me? You know, the other day, that good-for-nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Amori? Pretty please? Okay, I guess I will. Uh, is your stuffed toy that big? Cat in the background? Oh, I feel like we're on some kind of trip up in this game. And would I like to make toast? Yes! Can I eat it? Okay. No, it's just for decorative purposes, apparently. You got a stuffed toy! That's a stuffed toy? It looks like we broke the watermelon. Is that... Could it be? Wait, you didn't look very hard. It was in the corner, so... <laughs> hey, Kel. Look, it's my stuffed toy. What the heck? Uh, where did you get that? Amori found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. Ooh, burn. Serves you right, Kel. You should know better than to pick others. But Aubrey started it. And she was the one who was making fun of me for the mail, uh, mail? Yeah, that does say mail on my, on your what? Mole. It said mole, not mail. It looked like an A. That, was, that makes more sense, mole. <laughs> Aubrey? Fine. Thank you, Amori. I knew I could count on you. You're the best. Uh, anytime. Anytime. I'm I'm so glad to do this. A cat-shaped hole. Heck. There's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. Railroad. I've always had a problem saying railroad. Am I the only one? Uh, can I go this way now? Okay. Well, I gotta ask my friends to go with me, apparently. Hey, Amori. I'm glad it's all settled. Uh, those two always seem to be bumping heads. Mari and Basil invited us for a picnic at the playground. Uh, do you want to go see them? Yes. All right, everyone. Let's go, and Mari and Basil. <laughs> Going out, Mari. <laughs> He's, uh, here is your allowance for today. You got 50 clams. Sweet! Bro, they own some shrooms up in this game. Oh yeah, fresh air at last! Gotta love that nature. Well, let's go. So why were we getting... We were... So we were stuck in the white noise place, right? And... Okay, I'm just gonna assume all everything in this game's a dream. Hey, wait a sec. Help me up, guys. I'm stuck. If only you say please. Cal, stop messing around and get me out of here. Okay, okay, fine. Holy crap. <laughs> hmm. Took you long enough. Well, sorry, princess. Okay, well, uh, I don't know where I should be going, so we're gonna go down. What the heck? That doesn't look human at all. <laughs> it's like hitting him in his face. Look at this little cute 
that guy on the swing. Mary Basil. Basil's a funny name. Who would ever name their kid Basil? Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Kel's being mean to me again. Oh, no, not again. How could he? Shh, I'm not being mean. Uh, Aubrey's just being all whiny. Well, Kel, you've just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Believe me! No, believe me! <sighs> Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. I really like that about you. Come on, Mari. Uh, not now. Oh, Hira, you know just- I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. While we were waiting for you guys, Basil and I were going through the photo album. Did you want to join us? Of course. After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, get a load of this! Come on, Basil, take a picture of me! Sorry, Kel, I only take photos of people uh, when they least expect it. You like to take photos of people acting natural when they're not in front of a camera, right, Basil? Yeah, there's something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. I like that, I like that. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not there? Yeah, I guess you could put it that way. Sure, I can do that. Did you want to show us your photo album now? Uh, okay. But it's nothing amazing. Stop doubting yourself, I'm sure they'll be great. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry, I'll try to believe in myself more. Here, uh, that way we can all see. So this is them living their lives in bushes. <laughs> or in a thing. Well, they all, uh, they all look like they're having a wonderful time drinking milk and crap, and that guy is like completely black and white, and we're not gonna ask why. I mean, this is just sweet. But it doesn't make any sense. He says he was never here, right? The guy? Uh, a Morty? All of our feet in a circle. Can you guess whose feet there are? Well, I can guess that mine's the black one. Okay, well. These photos are also charming. You really know how to capture the moment. Thanks. I didn't take them all, though. Mary likes to steal my camera sometimes. Only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did you all want to come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, that sounds fun. Let's go. Uh, it's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. Okay. Hmm? I think I'll set this one out. You all go and enjoy yourselves. But if you're ever feeling weary, you can always stop by one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments today. And you can even save using my picnic, uh, basket. Oh, okay, that's the safe spot. Ah! Thanks, Mari. You always done so much for us. Bye, Mari. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Well, I think I should probably save the game. So far, it's a cute game. I'm going to swing to the moon. Mikal. <laughs> it's Mikal. It's me. Hey, Mori, guess what? I got some plans today. Big plans. Just stay put for a while. You'll see what I mean soon enough. Okay. Uh, barely talks so fast when she's excited. It gets really hard to keep up. Alright, so why is there humans and why is there monsters? So, this guy's got a puzzle going on. Hey, wait just a second! Where do you all think you're going? You can't leave without joining us for a game of hide and seek. Stay and play with us. The more the merrier. You wanna play hide and seek again? But, you know how this turned out last time. Yeah, sorry, barely. I think we're gonna have to pass. We're going to Basil's house now, so we'll catch up with you later. I like that. I like that that music. Not so fast. You guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? Uh, is it my face? My rough and tough exterior? At least I'm not as bad as boss. It's a good thing I banned him from the playground after what happened last time. I wonder what uh, that moron is up to now. Uh, good riddance. So, you want to play hide and seek, Basil? I can go either way. There is no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it up to Amori. What do you want to do? Amori, my best friend! Come on, you know how to play hide and seek, don't you? Uh, yeah. 
Well, that's what I thought. What's stopping you then? Come on, let's play. I'll round everyone up. I guess we're gonna play. Tin Hut? Oh, <laughs> All right, maggots, here's the rules. We're going to be entertaining ourselves with a little game of hide and seek. Here in my hands, I got some straw, see? Everyone here's gotta pick a straw. The one with the short straw is gonna be it, and we'll have to find everyone else. Easy enough, right? Yeah, I know how to play. Does he have candy stuck on his back? It's gonna be me, isn't it? I am the odd one out, even though I'm not a monster. <laughs> no, we all got our straws. Good. Now let's see who's gonna be it. Well, 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 looks like uh, the one with the shortest straw is Amori. Call that crap, man. I said intuition kicking in. Oh, wait, Amori is it? But Amori doesn't like to be alone. Are you gonna be okay, Amori? I can take your place if you want. I don't mind, really. Hey, I hear you're plotting over there. Uh, the straws make the rules, not me. Come on, don't be babies. It ain't so bad. Amori will be fine. When you're ready to play, walk up to the tether ball and close your eyes. And no peeking or else. Okay, I don't know what the point of this is, but we're doing it. Five, four, ah! Ah! I'm still looking, I'm cheating. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. Wait, I'm already, I'm right here. Okay. Whoa, you found me! I can, now I can help you find everyone. Now just don't tell Barely about this, you got, you think I need help? Look how big he is! <laughs> Nose goes, what the heck? If you're too loud, they'll hear us! Nose goes, bind goes! Be quiet, nose, we're hiding, remember? Aha! You've, uh, we found you, bun and nose? Nose? Nose goes. Oh, you know I can't stay mad at you. Let's play patty cake. Okay. It turns out there's not many places to hide for a guy my size, but this was still fun. <laughs> as long as Barely is happy, I'm happy. That's wholesome. Darn, you found me. <laughs> It's the easiest game of hide and seek I've ever played. Uh, are you one of the ones? Okay, well. <laughs> Wait, where am I? I was dreaming that I was on a private beach with servants fanning with me with palm leaves on every side when suddenly, wham! And now here I am. I must have fallen asleep while hiding. I guess that's game over for me, man. Dude, these people suck at hide and go seek. Let's find everyone else together, Amori. Th they're like not even into it. Okay. Well, they're not even hiding at all. Oh, hey, you know, I found a really good hiding spot, but Sean and Rin invited me to join them in their <sighs> exercise routine. It's fun and good for you. <laughs> you guys really should try this. It's uh, really <sighs> a workout. Man, I'm so tired. Wow, you really don't know how to say no to anyone, do you, Hero? Come on, Hero, we gotta help Amori find everyone else. All right, <sighs> I'm coming. Uh, bye, Sean, and this was fun. Yeah, let's do this again sometime. See you later, hero. Uh, we're not playing. We're exercising. Okay. Ah. <laughs> okay, no words. No words necessary. Whisper. You probably shouldn't disturb this. Neb and Daisy. Well, I guess they're not playing. Who's hiding in the grave? Or, oh, it's a mailbox. <laughs> I guess my mind is a little dark. I assumed it was a grave. Eternal banana. Why is there fried eggs on the ground and you can step on them? Boing, it's me, Happy. You found me, so that means I gotta do something else now. Oh, I know. I'm gonna count the alphabet backwards. Z, Y, X, W, V, U, O. Can you do that? I can't do that. If I were to be stopped by a cop, I would just have to like tell them to arrest me. Uh, you, you know, assuming they thought I was drinking, which I wouldn't do that while driving, but I'm just saying, if there was ever a moment I had to do it, I don't think I could do it. I'd be like, just take, just slap the cuffs on me. There's a straw on the ground, pull it out. Well, that wasn't that bad of a hiding spot, at least. Took you guys long enough, I thought I was gonna suffocate in there. How'd you like my hiding spot? Pretty good, eh? It looks like you pretty much found everyone else too. Unexpected, but I like it. Let's do a final roll call. What if someone's missing? Tin Hut! Van, here is always, buddy. Charlene, here. Mikael! <laughs> oh, what gives? I like Mikael, I don't know why. Happy, here. Browse. Ah! 
Bing's here. Bun. A.A. Ron. <laughs> Nose goes. Hero. Presents. Pre presents. Yawn. You really gotta do this every time, barely? Hey, that was a call, but... Aubrey? <laughs> Here I am! She's doing a little spin. Where's Basil? That's strange. I thought I saw him go hiding near that tree over there. Basil, where are you? Can you hear us? Basil? You can come out now. You already won. Uh-oh. Hello, Basil! Basil! Oh, no. I think they're in that tree. Hey, there's Basil. Basil, are you okay? Are you stuck? Oh! That's not a tree at all! <laughs> it's a boss! Boss, I should have known it was you, you good for nothing scoundrel! Let Basil go! Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil is our friend! Don't you dare hurt him! Let's go, uh, let go of Basil, boss! He didn't do anything wrong! <laughs> you stupid heads! Oh, you did not just claw. That's fine, Morge, right there. You think about. You think this is about Basil? Don't play dumb. You know why I'm here. How dare you not invite me to hide and seek? I'm the one who showed you all how to play in the first place. Hey, how, how can you do that to a person? How can you do that to poor boss? He looks like a nice guy, you know? And you're not even playing it right. How can you call it hide and seek without any body slamming? No. <laughs> oh, I thought she... <laughs> I thought he threw the girl. My flower crown! Hey, that's the flower crown we made for Basil. How could you? Let go of him, you bully. No. If I can't play with everyone, then no one can. This is a boss-only zone now. And you're not invited. Oh. Okay, well, here comes the RPG elements. Hey, look at this art style, though. Can we appreciate that? It's, like, really interesting. Alright, uh, well, we have toy skill attack and snack. I'm assuming a uh, snack is probably healing and stuff. Let's just attack, because I don't know what else to do. We're all just gonna attack. Is- oh crap, wait, ah! Is this like, uh, Undertale, where you're like, you're supposed to spare people? I didn't see anything about spare, though, you weaklings. You call that an attack? Boss takes 16 damage. He cracks his knuckles, so oh god, how does he even do that with his... So we can run... But I think... Wait, what a skill. Sad poem? Let's play a sad poem. Pep talk. I don't know what this does. I'm just like doing things. Annoy. And then we'll just... Attack. That's so cool! Wait. Wait, they have like emotions? He's sad? Huh. Boss cracks his knuckles. What will Mori and friends do? Well, I'll just keep attacking. I think we were doing pretty good. I mean, I don't know what we did to him. Wait, she's angry? Hey, that kind of hurt. This isn't fun anymore. Ooh, hit him right in the heart. I think uh, the poem worked. Oh, crap. We missed. I I hope I'm supposed to be doing this. I don't know. If I was live streaming this, you guys would be telling me I'd do everything wrong or something. Now you've made me angry. It's time for my special move. Body- Oh, don't you do it! Not Basil! Oh, okay. Oh, hit- They're toast! <laughs> uh, it's pretty funny, though. Oh. Okay, well. Amori did not succumb. Boss, huh? How are you still moving? Boss cracks his knuckles. What will more of your friends do? Should I keep fighting? Let's do the last attack. I like... I like how they're actually toast. That's freaking funny. Oh, we were victorious. I'm assuming that was supposed to happen. And we got 22 clams. This isn't fair. Rematch! I want a rematch! Oh. He just smacked them. <laughs> Basil, are you hurt? Uh, don't worry about me. I'm just fine. Not gonna lie, I really expected that to take a way more darker turn, and it didn't. I don't know if it's that kind of game, to be honest. I I'm assuming there are, there are, I mean, there was a warning in the beginning. There are some serious tones, like, you know, fair warning aside. But uh, other than that, like, I, I don't know if it's that bad, you know. 
It must be hard to see people have fun without you. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Hmm, I know that. Yeah, we're gonna teach the big bad guy a lesson. There, does that feel better? Basil, are you sure it's okay to do that? Wait, what was on the sign? I didn't even read it. Boss, it's bad news. It's a good thing that Mori held on during that final attack or else we would have all been toast. That's literally the cutest thing I've ever seen, like toast. It's okay, I trust him. When we were all fighting, he tried really hard to make sure I didn't get hurt. Is that true, boss? Oh, he's, he, he don't want to say. Hmm, that's a little baloney. I don't need to hear these lies. This is my spot. No one is welcome here. Aw, <laughs> that's kind of cute though. Well, he probably won't become a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we can all go to Basil's house now. That sounds good to me. We're leaving now, boss. Don't cause any trouble, okay? <laughs> He's a tree. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. No one will ever find him under the tree. So far, uh, I'm getting some uh, nice little vibes from this game. I like the art style and just the battle mechanic in, in general is really cool. Hey, you, uh, you over there. Oh, the mailbox is talking to me. Amori, I think that mailbox is talking to us. Maybe we should go check it out. You need to stop uh, smoking. Yes, hello, value customer. Welcome to my shop. Please buy something. So this is the shop. Well, I, well, I could, I should save up for the present. I have 72 clams. It's not what you wanted. It inflicts anger on a friend or foe. Why would I want that then? Why would I want to buy that? Um, I'm not gonna buy anything because I don't think we should. We should probably go save though after that battle, just in case I mess up. The squirrel wants something. I want to give flower to someone, but he's only interested in puzzles. If only I could flower. If only I could find a flower puzzle or something. Maybe then he would notice me. Oh, okay. Wait, was that under one of the things that I could buy? I didn't check. No. I mean, it is a present, but I don't think it's a flower puzzle. I like puzzles. <laughs> I like turtles. All the pieces are blank? That is a pretty tough puzzle. <laughs> ah, yes, yeah, some nutritious candy. Would you like to eat some? Yes. You and your friends feel like new. Okay, so that's how you heal. Okay, cool. Wait, no, I don't want to have a picnic. Crap. Oh, well, that's nice. That's just lovely. Oh, you can sprint? Holy crap. The grass sure feels nice here. Want to join us? Sure. I don't want you guys yelling at me in the comment section that I didn't, that I missed something, so I want to do everything. The stars shine brightly overhead. You don't have a care in the world. Uh, I learned observe. Oh, so there is a point to do things with people. You get like moves and stuff. Nose is my best friend. She can't say much, but she's really smart. Yeah, we kind of figured that out. All right, I think we can finally move on. South, right? Wait, what does this say? Train station pinwheel forest basil's house. Okay. Did we get into random battles? Is this like Pokemon? A watering can. Those are sunflowers. They're called that because they always face towards the sun. Is that true? I literally didn't know that. I just learned something new. And you probably did too. Don't lie to me. I'm not the only one that's stupid out there. That's what I want to be like. Someone who always sees the bright side of things. I agree. I agree. Why is that bush different? Okay. Oh, it's just a bush. I can't uh, get stuck on everything. Oh, these are sad flowers. The lily of the valley. It said that they're able to ward off evil spirits that can help people see a bright future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mari. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. Wholesome. Whoa! Uh, well, I, what the heck? <laughs> uh, what's that ugly plant creature? Hey, that looks like a scrub! All right, and Scrub Chen doesn't appreciate that. Uh, do you know, Kel? That's a sprout mole. Sprout moles are highly intelligent creatures, but become dangerously vicious when they are lost. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, stop that! They're stepping over the flowers! Holy crap, dude! Oh, he looks angry! <laughs> That's exactly what it says. Like us, Sprout Moles are also, uh, also feel emotions. Since this Sprout Mole is angry, its attack is higher. But on the other hand, it lowers its defense. So what are you saying is, so what you're saying now is the perfect time to strike. Come on, Amori, let's do this. All right, well, I guess I'll do that. 
I think it's really interesting that there's like emotions. It's like that's the first time I've ever seen an RPG do emotions like that. Oh, that was extremely easy. Amori grew to level two. Ah, most of the flowers are unharmed. That's a relief. Hey, Amori. Now that we're getting the hang of battling, here's a journal where we can keep track of any neat foes we come across. Okay, it's so like a monster list. Yeah. I know, I've been around the block when it comes to RPGs. Okay, well here's the menu, so I'm missing something. Let's keep on going. Let's venture on. These are roses. Can you tell, uh, can you guess who they remind me of? They remind me of Hero. Did you guess correctly? Roses come in many different colors and have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize admiration, orange roses symbolize passion, yellow roses symbolize friendship, and the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any of those in particular, or any rose. I think Hero is like all roses because he's versatile and universally loved. Okay. These are the type of flowers called uh, gladius, gladiolus, gladiolus, a gladio, what? Gladiolus are also known as sword flower. As you might guess, they represent strength of a character, someone who is honest and strong in normal moral values, who stands by their convictions. A, gladi a gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey because she's always true to herself. Ah, I see. So what you're saying is that Aubrey is really stubborn. Hey, no I'm not. Okay, let's move on. Oh no. Oh, not again. He doesn't look angry though. Stop twirling. <laughs> Stop, you're gonna get arrested. You're destroying all the flowers. Oh. <laughs> oh, I see. This sprout is happy. In that case, it has higher chance to hit our weak spots and do more damage. But this also means it has a higher chance of missing. I'm still gonna attack it. I don't think it matters. They can't be that strong. Oh, okay. So we attack first. Okay. Where's his health bar? Oh, okay. Yeah, that was easy. Bye-bye! Hmm. We seem to be running across a lot of foes with emotion. In case you didn't know, emotions can determine how strong or weak an attack is. Happy beats angry. Okay, alright, so this is what we gotta remember. Happy beats angry, angry beats sad. And sad beats happy. Oh, so I should have been sad. That's why you- Oh, okay, that's cool! Here, I even drew up a guide on how they work. I'm no artist, but I think they'll get the point. I'll put it in your pocket so you can check it out later. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's look at it. Cool, yeah, I- Yeah, it's- it's-, it's In a way, it's like Pokemon too, but instead of like... Emotion- Instead of like, uh, elements that would be in most RPGs, it's, um... Emotions. Which is, uh, unique, so that's cool. What is this, a cactus? Uh, they're cool and spiky. Actually, Kel, this is a cactus. It's more of a plant than a flower. And it's funny that you ask because they remind me of you. Is it because he's a prick? Hey, well, that's too, that too, but mostly cacti are very sturdy and resilient plants by nature. They don't need much care and could survive even in seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is that even you could take care of a cactus, Kel. Whoa, neat. Cacti are awesome. Cacti. Cacti? <laughs> what did I just say? Ah, these are white tulips. Plain and simple, bulbous, just like a mori. I don't know, I just think it's cute. Hey, you think I'm cute? You think I'm cute? Oh no, not another one. Oh cool. Alright, so I'm gonna try to do it like, like right this time. Okay, this problem is a bit sad. See how it's curled up in the fetal position? Yeah, yeah, totally. That means it won't do as much damage as normal. But it'll also take less damage to hearts and will lose juice instead. How sad. Let's put this out- let's put him out of his misery. Just because he's sad? Alright, let's just attack. Again, I don't think it's gonna matter. Oh wow, we are not doing very much damage though. He's losing juice! Yeah, we're not doing much damage at all. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Amori's party was a victorious. He gained 14 XP. I hope I'm not really doing something wrong by just like... Oh, I learned massage. I hope I'm not doing something wrong by killing these people. I have no idea. I mean, that's the normal thing to do in RPGs, right? Hi, everyone. You all came just in time for the lovely picnic. 
Feel free to rest here. Oh, okay. Everything is ready and all set up. I even brought some fruit. I'm guessing I can heal. You and your friends feel like new. Munch, munch, munch. Thanks, Mario. You're the best. And it's nothing. I'm just trying to look for, look out for all of you. Ah, oh, Mari, I wish I could be more like you. You always seem to have everything under control. That's not true at all. It just seems like that way from the outside. Either way, you all seem to make everything look easy. Yes, I agree. Mari is so effortlessly graceful. Don't you think so, Amori? Yeah. Aw, I guess I'll have to believe it a little bit if, if you all think so. My house is right this way. Are we all ready to go? I'm ready when you are. Well, I'll catch you later, Mari. Let me know if you need anything. See you soon. Okay. Oh, I'm going. Oh, that doesn't sound good at all. Oh, it's a big boy! Is it another boss? It looks like the Deku Tree from Zelda. Oh, I should have looked at the, the, the notebook again. Is he angry? Uh, I wish it told me. Ah, uh, what happens if we do observe? It's a, a ye old sprout. All right, let's just see what happens. All right, nine damage is not too bad. He rolls over. Amori took four damage. Ooh. Okay, that's not bad. Weak. Amori focuses his vision and observes him. Uh, what will Amori- okay. Oh god, we barely took anything though. What happens if I just- I'm just gonna do sad poem. I'm still not used to, to like what emotions are which. Oh, dang, 27 damage, okay. All right, well, at least he's not very strong. Wait, what? Oh man, this fight is pretty tough. But don't worry, we can all do this if we work together. It looks like we're gonna have to teach you all a little bit about teamwork. Let's try again, Amori. We'll get him this time. We didn't die. Oh wait, you notice anything? Yeah, I see, I see the bar. You should see a new bar at the bottom. This is our collective energy. By using our energy, we can defeat this foe together. Just attack and you'll see. So I'm guessing we can do like a, a special attack that builds up. Let's try it. Oh wait, trip, what? Wait, what is happening? I'm just trying to understand. Did you see all the bubbles that popped up when we attacked? That's called a follow-up. After you attack for a limited time, you can use energy to perform a follow-up move. Just press any direction and arrow and see what happens. All right. Trip, what happens if I trip? Oh, he fell. What? Uh, past to Amori? Why did I do that? <laughs> uh, look at here. Okay. Oh, I don't really get it. Phew, man. You guys, this guy really is tough. When he attacked us, did you notice that our energy went up? When we take damage, we gain energy. Think of it as a chance to make a comeback. Okay, I'm still not following. Attack again. Uh, pass to a Mori. Look at... Dang, okay, I gotta get the hang of this. Nice, we're full of energy. This is the perfect time to use our special attack. I freaking called it RPG logic. After you attack, press, uh, okay. Hope you're all ready. Come on, everyone. Let's show this big guy what we're made of. Unison attack! Wait, how do I do it? Do I have to attack first? I'm pressing the button it told me to press. Or maybe it's not full yet. Maybe I'm just assuming. We can do better than that. I'll show you. Oh, they feel angry. OK. 
Okay, why is she angry? Why are you so mad? Oh, he's almost dead anyway. We got this. I'll just keep attacking. Screw it. Oh, wait, no, I should have released energy. Ah, oh, no. I saw that. Wait, Pastel Mori. Oh, he's dead. Dang it. I didn't get to do my special attack. I hope we save it. We learned Snap. Okay, it's gonna take me a little bit to get used to that. I wasn't sure exactly. It didn't explain why you need to do those things. And there you have it. Here is Battle Tutorial 101. And I'm sure that as we fight more battles, our teamwork will improve over time. You guys, it was so amazing. That was nothing. I've taken down way bigger guys than that. I should teach you some of my skills one of these days. Basil, I know you're not the type of that likes to fight, but it's good to know how to defend yourself too. You know, I've actually been working on a book all about battles. Maybe we can all study together next time. I'll give it to Amori to hold on to for now. You guys got- or you got self-help guide. As we get stronger, I'll update the follow-up section of the self-help guide, so be sure to check it out every now and then. Amori, you should know. When we get XP in the- okay, we get more skills. Skills are powerful. Okay, yeah, we know. After you learn a new skill, don't forget to equip it from the player menu. Oh, you actually have to equip them. Okay, that's new. I didn't know that. I thought we would just have them. Okay, well, I should, uh, equip them. Okay, so you probably don't have to replace them. Maybe you can do four at a time. It didn't say. It's a freaking shoe! <laughs> they li Basil lives in a shoe! She's named after a food and she lives in a shoe. Say cheese! Hey, we're not living our everyday life. <laughs> it came out kind of blurry. Well, it's okay. It gives it character. Hope you don't mind the photo. Yeah, that's what everyone says when something goes bad. <laughs> that's what I say. Of course we don't mind. I want to see it. Oh, sure thing. We all look so cute. How's my hair? I want to see. I want to see. Oh, hey, Amori, do you want to look at the photo too? <laughs> you can. He has the main character look, doesn't he? It's too bad that it came out kind of blurry, but you all still look cu uh, so cute. I should add it to my collection. Woohoo! Another shot from the photo album. Move over, Aubrey. I can't see. Hey, stop pushing. You already had your turn. Hey, get out of my way, Kel. Wait, hold on. There's no need to fight. Me first. No, me. Oh, God. There they go again. Ah, stop it. You guys are knocking me over. Aw, oh, she dropped it. There you did it again to poor Basil. Whoops. Oh, my gosh. Basil. Uh, I'm so sorry. Are you okay, Basil? You two are in big trouble now. This is why the both of you need to learn how to get along. I'm sorry, we didn't mean it, Hero. Please don't tell Mari. It's okay, don't worry about it. Accidents happen. Oh, she dropped like all of her stuff. I didn't even see that. Here's your photos. It doesn't look like any of them got damaged. Let's put them in your photo album together. Thank you, Hero. Let's go inside my house first. Remember to wipe your feet before you come in. Always gotta wipe the feet before you go in the house. Always. Basil's photo album. Uh, his most precious- Why did I think it was a girl? I mean, you can see why I would think that, right? Are you ready to put the photos back, Amori? Yes. Yay, let's get started! Hmm, darn. I don't think I remember the order of all these photos. Don't worry about it. Uh, well, why would you care about the order? Amori has a really good memory, so I'm sure we'll figure it out in no time. Do I really have to put them back in order? How, how am I supposed to remember? I didn't know I was supposed to remember something like that. Okay, why do I feel like this is going to be extremely important to the game? <laughs> Wait, should I- can I read the description? No, I can't. Bro, this is going to be super important. I already know. Oh, this- I don't like this. I don't like this. Uh, there! Good as new! I'm really sorry for pushing you over, Basil, even though at least half of it was Kel's fault. Yeah, I promise to never fight with Aubrey ever again, unless she starts it first. 
Don't worry about it. I know you only wanted to see my photo album. Thank you for helping me put it back together. Hmm? That's strange. That photo must have been loose. What is this? Did I take this photo? Something about it seems... so familiar. No. That can't be. Ah! Oh. oh! What? <laughs> Murray? Oh! Well, this sure took a turn, didn't it? All of a sudden, these uh, drawings seem more scary. You booted up your laptop. What would you like to do? Just open the journal. Today I visited my friends, everything was okay. Okay, so that changed, I think. Uh, stare at the screen. What would you like to do? Okay, log off. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap, it felt nice. Meow? Not much to do around here, is there? Tissues? That's kind of moving now. I, don't, I can't really do anything with it, though. What the heck happened with that photo? What did it mean? Is there anything else I could do? Oh, okay, now I can... I tried interacting with it already. It's pitch black inside. You can't see anything. Well, I've heard of black lights, but not quite like this. You know, it's false advertising. They're really blue. <laughs> yeah, and one thing I do know, too... Is that, uh, there's, I think, I, I only saw it because of a thumbnail. Like, you know, I've seen this game around, but I, I obviously haven't, like, watched or played any of it. Uh, but something about naming yourself a Mori, I don't know what that's about, but I, I think I'm gonna try it whenever it happens. I'm sure you guys will tell me all about it, I don't know. As long as you don't spoil me. Stab! No! No stab! No, I don't want to do that! Unequip the knife! Ah, <laughs> uh, well, I guess I have to do it. Guess I don't have a choice, do I? Don't! I'm sure it's a dream, right? Look at all of us. Those are all of our memories together. They're a little sad now. But we should be happy that they happened at all. Let's make some new memories together, okay? So what happened? Dude, I got chills. You see a boy sleeping in his room. What's his name? I can't not do it. Now that I know about it, I can't not do it. Alright, I can't do it in all capitals. It's gonna bother me. Okay. But you can't? Try it all capitals. Oh, you actually can't do it. Okay. I hope I'm not missing something, guys. I can't do anything! Do I have to fill it up? That would be stupid. Why would you need to do that? Okay. What? What if what do you do? You can't uh, you can't name him anything. <laughs> I'm I'm literally googling how to name yourself Omori. You can't I can't name myself. It's a glitch! I swear, I cannot name myself. Look. Look, I'm gonna name him Nuts. His name is Nuts. 
You, there's no way to name yourself the game. I'm stuck. And look, I acknowledge that I'm completely stupid. Okay? At times, it can really seem like I just have no brain cells. I totally understand that. But I think I am capable as a human being to name myself in an RPG game without having any problems. So, uh, why? Why is it so hard? I, I've tried with the keyboard. You press Z, nothing. I named him nuts. It doesn't work. What can I name him? Ah, no! What? Why did that work? Wait, Sunny? Okay, so Sunny works. How come I couldn't name him any of the things that I wanted to name him? Why give me the option? You're not really gonna give me the option. I mean, <laughs> imagine. <laughs> I'm sorry for my childish ways. I guess my name is gonna be Sunny because I literally don't have a choice, so. Wow, that is the hardest time, that's the hardest time I've ever had trying to name someone in a game. It's not like it's an online game where I can't like curse or something. Like what? I'm just, I'm, my mind is boggled by that. But it seems like I'm in the real world now. Hey Sunny, it's Mommy. I'm still in the city setting things up for our new home. Did you finish packing yet? The movers are gonna be at our house in a few days, so I left a few things for you to do before they arrived. Also, sorry, mommy messed up. I forgot to tell the electric company that we need a few extra uh, days before we're ready to move, so the lights might cut out sometime tonight. Anyway, I know nothing. I know moving to a new place can be a little nerve-wracking right now, but I know it's a change of. But I think a change of scenery will be positive for both of us. I know you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but you might want to say goodbye to your old friends before we leave. Kel, Kel has been trying hard to get a hold of you ever since we put our house up for sale. He's been calling us every week for the past few months. He seems a little lonely. Maybe you should pay him a visit. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Bzzz. I think we're hungry. Yep. Are you sure you want to go downstairs? Why is that a bad thing? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna save the game. I think we're probably gonna save it for next episode. Because I want to know if, like, I messed up with my naming of my character. That's where I'm gonna need your guys' help, guys. Mom's bed. It matches too hard for you to sleep comfortably. Oh, wait. Is this a save point? Okay. You know what? We're gonna save in the second slot. Yeah. Okay. So now we're in the actual world. Okay. Well, guys, I think that's a good place to end it. If you would like to see more, I would love to make longer episodes. But it's really, um, if you guys want to see me play it, you know, I, I've been getting so many comments, so I hope you want to see more, and I'll love to do more. It's really just whether or not you guys want to see it. <laughs> I want to see it. Subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.